Good morning, it's high school. Thank you for viewing Ram TV. Today is Monday, October 15th, 2012. Student dismissal times for today are as follows. 2.30, junior high boys and girls soccer. Sign-ups for winter sports will begin Wednesday, October 10th in the athletic office. All participants in winter sports must complete paperwork. There will be a sign-up sheet for the mock trial team outside of Mr. Shirt's room, D114, until October 19th. The mock <coughs> trial team competes against other area teams in a courtroom setting. This is open to students in grades 9 through 12. If you have any questions, please see Mr. Shirt. Super 60 brunch students are reminded that the deadline to turn in your brunch reservations is Friday, October 19th. This is a reminder to the juniors and sophomores who sign up to take the PSAT test. The test will take place on Wednesday, October 17th during periods 1 through 4 in the LGI room. Students should report to their period 1 class for attendance and then report to the LGI room. Attention High School Math Club. The first math league contest of the year will be held directly after school in Mr. Tokarski's room on Tuesday, October 16th. There will be a meeting of the high school reading team on Tuesday, October 16th after school until 4.30 p.m. in the library. Students attending the Pittsburgh Glass Center on November 6th are reminded that the final payment is due to Mrs. Ringler in the art room by October 26th. Congratulations to the students who performed or exhibited work in the Fall Fine Arts Day, which took place here at the high school yesterday. All of the performances, both groups and individuals, were excellent. Scholastic Quiz competes tonight at Votec at 7.20 with Central Cambria. The JV team will not compete, so varsity team must be there at 7. A Christmas story rehearsal will be held on Tuesday, October 16th at 3 p.m. Actors and techies are urged to attend. Calendars are available. Check your email or talk to Mr. Miller. The girls' volleyball team will be sponsoring a pink out Tuesday, October 18th against Bishop and Court. Order your pink out shirt from one of the players or stop in the main office. Cost is $12. Sad Safe Sofa Contest is back again this year. All students are eligible to, all, are the, uh, eligible to win. <laughs> Make a creative slogan that represents making good choices. Win a perfect cozy seat in the end zone for the senior football game on Friday, October 19th. You also win free food and drinks delivered to you and a friend. Turn in your positive slogan to Miss Stone by the end of ninth period on Wednesday, October 17th. The winner will be announced on Thursday, October 18th during school. Anime Club members will be participating in the Johnstown Halloween Parade October 25th. <coughs> After school math tutoring on Wednesday, <coughs> October 17th will only be until 3.30 p p.m. If you plan to attend, make sure your ride is here at 3.30 p.m. There will be a junior, senior, and class officer executive board meeting on October 18th at 6.30 a.m. in room D117. Be prompt. We are still looking for 7th and 8th graders to join math counts. Practice will be held today and every Thursday after school <coughs> until 4 in Ms. Smyche's room, B214. Please come see what it's all about. Here's a short video about the Society of Gaming Enthusiasts. Woo! I am Heavy Weapons Guy. This is my new weapon. Kaboom! <laughs> The meeting of the Society of Gaming Enthusiasts is this Friday after school until 1.45. You will be able to play, play and discuss games with your peers. Come by and try it out. You can sign up outside in Mr. Jacobs room. Attention 7th and 8th grade football teams. P please take home and wash all of your equipment at the, at the conclusion of your last game. Make sure your lockers and areas are clean. Equipment turn-in will be in roughly two weeks, so listen for the announcements for the day. There will be a middle school forensics practice after school until 4 p.m. in room B216 today. Random fact of the day. In 1963, baseball pitcher Gaylord Perry remarked, they'll put a man on the moon before I hit a home run. On July 20th, 1969, a few hours after Neil Armstrong set foot on the moon, Gaylord Perry hit his first and only home run. Wow. As always, please check the school bulletin and power school for all announcements. Thank you. <laughs> 